Welcome back. The Halloween spirit is certainly all around us now with a pumpkin on every corner, but during the dry summer, some farmers had to find some ways to keep their crops healthy. Eyewitness News reporter Thomas Battle has the story. The pumpkin harvest is in full swing across Pennsylvania, but this summer lacked rainfall for many farmers. A little bit of moisture in the spring when they're germinating, and during the summer, an average about an inch of rainfall a week. But we have been below average in rain throughout the summer. Harry accidentally found a way to help his pumpkins grow this year. We happened to grow them on a wetter farm this year, and we grow them under old strawberry plastic, which benefited us big time. That plastic kept what little moisture they had at the surface. Other local farms relied on irrigation when needed. Uh, fortunately for us, we irrigate our, our sweet corn and uh, other vegetables as well as pumpkins. So we had a real nice crop, maybe a little less than other years. This time last year, many farms were soaked after heavy rains fell throughout the summer. Yeah, absolutely a lot better to be dry, especially if you have the ability to irrigate them and can give them the water when they need it. Without that needed irrigation this summer, many farms have struggled. Their yields would be way down and their size would be really way down. Uh, a lot of them probably didn't even get many pumpkins at all that I know of, you know, that they just burned up. A bigger problem than the rain this year has been the growing cost to plant. Fertilizer prices have doubled, fuel prices have more than doubled, chemicals, seed. Uh, to plant our crops, we probably spent twice as much money this year as we have any other year to plant. Pumpkins can still be bought through Halloween or until they run out. In Luzerne County, Thomas Battle, 2822, Eyewitness News. Both farmers say they look forward to Halloween as it signals the end of their busy summer growing months.